everybody. Tonight's little update I thought I'd do in front of the fire. Just lit the fire. It's beautiful. And here we are. Now I've got to look. I don't think I'm being rude. I'll tell you who's who. That's a little girl, this one I think. Yes, yeah, so there's Scouty about there. And the little girl there. Of course, Louis. Look at him, isn't he beautiful? They're all stunning. And this is little Suki here. She's, <clears throat> I think she's surprised and saw she's going to be a little, a little seal point, I think, looking at that face now. Going to be a little seal point with blue eyes. As is Mishka. Well, we weren't surprised about Mishka. Mishka was always probably going to be a sort of seal point. And uh, they're just at a wonderful age now starting to play starting to interact with us and they're just gorgeous you see there goes that's scout i think over there yes coming back towards us but they're all just starting to excuse me because i mean mix still has to do her motherly duties she doesn't care where she does them and we're thankful to her for being such a good mother she's terrific she's actually quite fat She's put on quite a bit of weight. She's eating quite. She's eating for Australia, but never mind. That's the way it goes when they feed him. And as you can see, these kittens, we got a worm again this week. So it'll be interesting. Look how fat their bellies are. They're all little porky little bellies. So it'll be interesting to see just how much weight. Look at little Suki over there. Come here, scouty bat. Really don't want you going behind the fire, darling boy. Come on. Come over here. There's plenty of room to play over here. There they are. So they're all developing beautifully. Couldn't hope for anything better, really. They're all growing. They're all quite got quite a lot of weight on them. In fact, I think you'll find they've halved their weight again in two weeks as to what they were when we first uh, wormed them. We may even do that tomorrow night. Try and bring it on the four, back to four weeks. So then six weeks, I'm still, I've still yet to ring the vet about the vaccinations and see what they suggest. And we're actually thinking for those that can go, sorry, of course, Emma and Stu know doesn't apply to them because Mishka's flying. But for those that can go to their homes that can be picked up from here if people want to make the drive down to Mortlake. Um, you're quite welcome and probably will let them go somewhere between probably around about 10 weeks, I reckon. 10 weeks of age. Otherwise, you can meet me at the airport when we bid Miss Girl farewell to when she goes up to Queensland and uh, can save most Melbourne people a trip. And Nicola... Nicola of course, in Ballarat, you're only an hour and a half from us. I mean, if we can tie it in, if we happen to be coming down that way, we can even meet you, or you're quite welcome to pick her up. Um, please, though, if you do pick them up early, do remember they're not fully vaccinated and do make sure you take precautions. There's Suki hoeing into that bit of a, a board there. She's beautiful too. She's probably the little, littlest one. It's a bit of a toss-up. There's not much in it, really. She is a dirty little face. But there she is. She's going to be a seal point. Zane and Narana, she's going to be a little seal point. I think she's going to have quite a dark body too. She possibly, I don't think she'll be as dark as Harvey, but who knows. And here's little Mishka, of course, wanting all the attention. Aren't you, baby girl? Hmm? Your big brother's off for his operation tomorrow. You can see they're much more animated. This is the first time in front of the fire for some of them. A couple of them have been out. In another couple of weeks, they will be going every which way, from one end of the lounge room, and you've literally got to have eyes in your bum to watch them. They're swinging off, Mummy, and oh, this little man is just so... Absolutely 
determined to go over behind the fire, which I don't want him to. Hmm? So his eyes are changing already. Um, the little seal points, of course, they're, they're always there. Eye colour will remain blue. I'm almost 100% certain of that. This little man, I think he's going to change to a green colour. They're already on the change. And the little girl. Here she is. Hers are two. They're bluey green, but they're going to change. I'd say they're going to have green or yellow eyes like Dad, the, ba the darker guys. Two little light ones will have blue eyes. They've just, Suki's just realised their mother's there, and that's actually the milk bar. But she's been preoccupied, she's been distracted by something. Now there she goes. See, as Mix goes along now, she starts to sit on her milk bar a bit more. She's still licking them and whatnot, but she's pretty much of a soft touch. If they really want to drink, she'll give them one. This little man's got a bit of a wandering... Um, Little scouty about you, a little bit of a wandering man, aren't you? Hey, look at you. You beautiful boy. It's going to be a little bit hairier than, uh, I hope we can make all the predictions than, uh, Sparrow was going to say, but really, we can make all the predictions in the world and be wrong. Actually, I had the wrong one. That was a little girl then I just picked up. That's got the wandering bit. This is scouty bats. That's a real Sparrow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's scary about. But look, I think he's trying to get in for a drink now. Clean her face, Mix. You haven't cleaned the eye jam out yet. But anyway, there they are. And that is the update for today. And they're growing and doing everything they should. And so probably for those that can take theirs, if they want to come and pick them up from here at 10 weeks old, if that's the way we go, well, you're just a bit under halfway now. So there's Mishka climbing up my leg. No, she's not. I think she's trying to use it as a scratch. No, she's caught there. You're caught, darling. Yeah, there's a good girl. They've got very, very sharp little claws. And this is, I'm not sure. I think that's a little girl. I think she's almost a little girl that's going, a little miss that's going to um, Ballarat. I think she's almost going to be the cheeky little Lola of the litter, this one. This one's, Miss, I want a cuddle. I want it right now. Thank you. You'll give it to me or I'm going to scream until I get it. This little girl's a lovely, delightful little, quiet little girl, little Suki. She's going to be a little girl, I think, too, like her mother and her father. And Louie, look at him. He's up to no good over there. Don't lick any of that. We just don't want to lick what ash drops out of the fire but anyway that's i've been not going for too much longer i'm sorry i didn't get to do an update for a couple of days i usually like to do one every day but we have had have had a bit on and it's the first lot of days off d's had properly for about three weeks now so we've been trying to get a few things done of course that and battling the weather down here it's been absolutely atrocious we've got two nice days Yesterday and the day before, if you can call, you know, windy nice. Um, and now we're back to the horrible, probably about nine degrees, raining and awful. So tomorrow I'm going to go out to the shipping container and get their litter tray. They can start using the litter tray. And I think I usually start them off about anyway for five to six weeks i might start them off in the middle though i don't want to throw too much at them at once but i think they're nearly ready to start going on to a bit of milk a little bit of whiskers kitten milk so that's if you see that on special in your supermarket they will still be having drinks of that i usually give them when they leave here they generally have free access to dry food and they have 
a nice warm drink of Whiskers Kitten Milk for supper and for breakfast as well. So, and I'll try and I'll tell you a bit more, make a video on what they're being fed before they leave here so you can refer to it. But anyway, better go because it's over 10 minutes. Thanks for watching.